Hey, I'm just Vosco and we're back in... I say back in, we're in a new game. We're in Evil Democracy 1932. Now, I've had a dabble with this game to see how it plays. I think I've got the hang of it. I have been watching um, Ajax Post Plays play this game and that's helped me out a little bit. So let's jump in and see what we can do. So we're going to go in, new game. We're going to go Great Britain, of course. And now we get to choose our party. Obviously, I presume these are, it's easier being conservatives and then it gets harder being anyone else. But obviously, we don't want to be the big parties like conservatives, Labour Party and Liberal Party. No, no, no. We want to go, we want to go lower so we're a tiny little party and we work our way up. That's the plan. So Labour centre left. We want to be around like left area sort of thing. Um, centre right, centre left. Independent Labour Party might be good. Far right, definitely not. Right, nope. Centre right, nope. Far left. I don't want to be far left either. Centre left, Scottish National Party. I think we're going to have to go with the Independent Labour Party. Do you know what I would like? I'd like the ability to, to, to design my own party. And, and rather than be in a party that already exists, let us put our own party in. I think that would be a really nice addition. Um, that might just be me, but I, I, it would be nice to design my own logo, make my own party, decide where I'm going to fit into all of this. Initial budget. Um, I'm presuming this is hard, easy. Hard starting with 100,000, then you've got a million, then middle of the road is 2.5 million, and then you've got really easy going up to 7.5 million. Let's go 2.5 million. So it sort of gives us a rough, a, a good figure to start with, but not too easy. That's the plan. Uh, party supporters, nothing. Finance, nothing. So this, this should be fun. Let's press start, and this is very... Uh, I don't like the fact the screen moves when you move your mouse around. I see no point in this whatsoever. Hello. Boop, 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 boop. Um, this is basically our office. A bit like Gear City. You've got your office and you've got all these different buttons that you can do things on. Um, well, we've got a budget of 250 million, which isn't great at the moment. We do have a free, a free leader here. And I'm actually tempted to put the leader on strikes. Because playing through, I find strikes are definitely one of our... Our more... Do you know what? Sponsors might be a better idea. Because sponsors is where the money comes from. Once the money starts coming in, we can hire other leaders for newspapers and strikes and things like that. I might play this a different way to how I played it before. Because before, I put this gentleman here straight into newspapers. But I'm actually tempted to put it into sponsors. Can I put you in here? There we go. Right, how much does a new leader cost me? Ooh, quite a lot of money. So probably not at the minute. We need to find some sponsors. We need to hire some reporters. So journalists. Let's go right to the top. We need to find a newspaper journalist. So we want the best there is. Which seems to be... You're very good. 10, 8, 8, 8, 8. 10, 9, 6... Or maybe you're better. Same price, but better overall. So let's hire you. We also want someone for investigations. Uh, again, we've got two candidates. They're a bit rubbish in anything else, but that's fine. We can we can have one of those. We'll hire one of those. Uh, I'm probably going to go with you. And then we need someone for interviews. Because we want them to interview our leaders and show how good our, our, our party is. As far as I can gather. Uh, okay, so interviewers, we got... You are just going to do interviewing, but... Do I go all out and go for the 10994? Or do I cut back and go for this one? Because he's only going to be interviewing. Do you know, I think I'm going to spend a bit of money. So we've got some we've got some journalists. Now we go to this area and we tell our journalists what we want them to do. Did I get someone to do newspaper? I did. So this person is our newspaper person. So we can put them up here onto newspapers. 
We didn't get a leaflet person. Ooh, we should probably get that. Uh, you are our investigator, you're our interviewer, so we're going to get our interviewer interviewing our leader. There we go, lovely. And we're going to get our investigator doing, getting some compromising material on, on one of the other parties. Now, I'm not really sure how this works. Like, you've got rating one, two, three, but it... Rating for what? Is this just rating of who's the easiest to get compromising material on? Don't know. So we'll go with the SMP to start with. We do need a leaflet journalist. So let's go back to here and... Sp oh, wait. We don't need to do that. We've already done it. You're good at leaflets. So let's hire you. We'll go back to here and we were gonna, we're going to put you up into there like that. And that is a basic startup. Uh, we do get to, once we get some articles, we can put them in print. Uh, so we'll go to here, add articles, and then choose what we want in our newspaper and leaflets and things. Um, what else can we do? We got the map. The map is the important bit. This is where our votes make all the difference. We want to get all these people on side. As you can see at the minute, we've got one... P no, we're not even on here. We are not on here whatsoever. So that's always good. We've still got quite a bit of budget. We can send out, if I go back to headquarters uh, and we go to staff, we've got campaigners. We've got promoters who deal with distributing the leaflets and the newspapers. And then we've got activists. I think you use activists right at the end. I'm not really sure on that. We, I haven't really learnt how activists do what they do, so we will use those later on. But at the moment, we're going to we're going to concentrate on campaigners. So let's hire some campaigners. Uh, I think we probably need a good amount of campaigners. Income after hiring is what I'm keeping an eye on, because we do want our money still to come in. So that maybe wait, 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 wait. No, we do need them. Oh, it's just a lot of money. Like, it really affects our income. So if we go income after hiring 58, can I get around 50,000? Oh, bit back a bit. Oh, oh, there we go. We'll have about 500. We'll, we'll get those. We're going to go to the map. And then we're going to choose... Uh, is this the right place? Yes, we're going to send 100% of them out and we're going to send them equally to all regions. So they've gone out. They're, they're, they're now out there. Um, so if we press next turn, we should see, this is where we want to keep looking up here, we should see our voters go up a tad, a tiny little bit, and hopefully our supporters go up, our sponsors. So let's press next our voters did go up, but our sponsors did not. So that's all right. Um, now, this is where we choose our dogmas. Um, we are center left, which is this column here. So this would be ideal for us to go to. Now, every single one of these has a positive effect and a negative effect. So the positive effect is the parameter party loyalty for your random junior leader has increased to 400. Um, party loyalty for one of your junior leaders has the party loyalty parameter for a random junior leader has decreased to 50. Yeah, it, that means something. I'm going to go with it because it is our ideology. So let's go for it. We're going to choose that. Have we got any articles yet? No. So it is pointless sent printing anything at the moment. So we're going to go to give a reporter assignment... What? 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 We've got we've got them assigned. They're doing things. Leave me alone. Uh, let's go next turn. Have we got any articles yet? We do. We have an interview. So we've got one article. We can send that out. There we go. We'll print a couple of newspapers. Fifty thousand, shall we say? How much is that going to cost us? Actually, we could go a hundred. Mm. New voters. So that really affects that a lot. I'm thinking 150,000. That, oh wow. So printing a lot more leaflets really does help. 
Total price, 577000 um, We have to hire promoters, so the people to hand out the, the newspapers and leaflets. And we need 250 of those, so we're going to press hire now. And we're going to press print. And we've just uh, spent a chunk of money. So let's go to the map. Can we do any protests yet? Now, protests, I think, are so important. They make a huge difference. So we're going to start on the east. We're going to all... Oh, we need... Can we get a, a new person? So I'm not really sure what I'm looking at here. I just go for the highest numbers. So we've got 79 and 70. That seems quite good. 78 and 62, not great. 77 and 74... So we're going down on Charisma, but up on Determination. So I'm thinking this might be a good choice. Level of belief is quite high as well compared to everyone else. So we're going to hire you, and we're going to put you in strikes. There we go, like so. And now we don't have enough money at the moment, but we will do. We just need to build up our money. So I've gone next turn. Our voters are 371. We are on, on this chart now. We've got 2%. 2% of the voters. That's not bad. I don't think we can afford one of these yet. No, we need a lot more. Um, so let's go to next turn. And if you're wondering why I'm not doing a newspaper every turn. Newspapers you can only do every five turns if I'm correct. So we've used one turn, so we need to do another four turns before we can do another newspaper. Which is great, because it gives us time to get some information on... On... get some more articles done up, basically. If we go to here... We should... Um, maybe I'll wait. Wait till the next newspaper goes out, then we could probably interview our new leader. One, yeah, because we've got the other leader who's doing the... the the strikes now, so that's good. So let's go forward a couple of turns. You have the, the voters go down every single time you click this. There you go. You can see it's gone down. So you have to constantly be trying to do things. But without the money, we don't have that option at the moment. Let's go and see if we can do a protest yet. Not quite yet. Which is a little annoying. Let's go to headquarters. How much interviews almost finished so let's go next turn and we should have a few more articles now which we do so if we put one of these in we've got a plus three on that which is good and we've got the smp um party thing which is great now we can add these into here to say they're going to be in the next issue i don't know what that does but it does something so let's print Mm, 75,000? We don't have a great deal of money, so maybe 50 and 100 will be a bit cheap. Like so. Which should have helped. Our voters have gone up a little bit. Now we want to go and change what we're doing. So stop interviewing him. Now you're my interview. No, you're my, you're my interviewer. So you're going to interview our new leader. Uh, you are going to find some compromising material on new party new party uk there you go you get some on them there we go lovely so let's go to the next turn we'll go from we'll probably drop a couple of voters we didn't we went up we went up by three thousand voters so that's good and money's coming in now we definitely need to do some strikes we still don't have the money for it which is a little annoying <coughs> clear my throat i do apologize so um, let's go again. Per turn, we are making more money every single turn. We're not getting anywhere close to being able to do a protest yet. I'm just going to keep pressing next turn until we get somewhere close. Our budget... Ah, oh, there we go. So we can do it now. So we're going to start in the east. Are we? I think we should start in the north, personally. Voters. There's a lot more voters in the north than anywhere else. And allies. We've got a lot more allies as well. So if we go organize, and now we should see on the next turn a big jump. So we're going to go from 355 to 584. That is how much difference it makes. It is a huge amount of difference. Now we need to add a new article. 
You're plus two for that interview. We could go the BNP and get them in there. And then on the next one, we'll have an interview with you, an interview with you, and we'll get the SMP and the BNP in there like so. I think I'm doing this right. If anyone knows if I'm not, please let me know in the comments below. So now we've got circulation of newspapers. We want to we wanna get a good amount out. So if we do that, that's going to cost us most of our budget. But it'll be worth it, I think. So we're going to go from 584 and we're going to go up to 586. It do, newspapers don't seem to add a lot. I definitely think the protests are the way to go. But again, it is very much just building up building up the money to do that. If we go up here, we're doing better in the north. We're in fourth position, fourth position, uh, fourth. And then as you get further down, we are less. Ireland, we're in eighth position, which is not good. If we click on the northwest, we get information, which is nice. And you can, you can sort the information. So if I go total, it will show you we are in third position in this particular area. Which, if you look at what the Labour Party and Conservatives have got, we're still quite a long way behind. Uh, per turn, we're making £315,000. I'm hoping that's going to go up on the next turn. It is £323,000. So let's go next turn again. Have we got enough money to do one of these yet? Not quite. So we're just going to keep going until we've got enough. There we go. We've got enough money to do one of these. We're going to organise one in the safe. So let's do that. And we're going to go from 565 voters up to 667 voters. We are not gaining voters as fast as everyone else. But hopefully we can turn it around and get some oomph into it. I don't think that's bad. We're doing okay. We're improving our situation all the time. So now we're making £413,000 on this turn, £420,000 on the next turn, which is really good. Let's print as many papers as we can afford. Should we do it? We'll go 150 and 200 Do you think that's good? What's that going to do? New sponsors goes could possibly go up a lot. No, I'm going to go 200 on leaflets and we'll print that and hopefully that will do some improvements Which it did a little bit of improvement now. We've got to choose a new dogma We've got the option in our category of center left. We can do justice for all I think that is a good option. We could go far left where we've got all people are subject to mandatory labor Definitely not uh, if we go here, Justice for All, we get a positive and negative. You, ca you can vary between the columns, but I personally think if we are a centre-left party, we should go with what is centre-left. And that is exactly what I'm going to do. What are you? Equal. The party's funds have increased by 15%, which is a lot of money. Salary expenses for the staff are 5% higher. So are you better... Except journalists. Are you better off, really? Really? Because you're, you're getting money in one hand and giving it away in another hand. I'm, I, I'm just going to stick with justice for all. There we go. And let's go next turn. We definitely need to get another protest on the go. Obviously, we can't do the north for another 16 turns. We can't do the south for another 21 turns. I, where's our leader gone? Why have we lost our leader? No, 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 no. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, your party loyalty. If the parameter is four to zero, the leader will step down and leave the party. Even though I've paid all that money for them. Are you having a laugh? Hmm. So ideally, we'd go for you because you're 74 and 77. Which is good. But your, your, your level of belief is rubbish. Your level of belief is much better. The only thing I don't want to go for him for is he, his, his profile picture is identical to our other bloke. 76 and 68 with 29. Maybe you'd be good? 
71 and 61. I'm going to go with this gentleman here. We're going to hire you. We don't have enough money. Of course we don't. Her. Wait, so who am I interviewing then? Let's go to our journey. No, wrong one. Let's press the right button. If we go to here, you don't have a task anymore, do you? You're an interviewer, so interview our candidate there. There we go. We're going to go next turn. We need to hire a leader, but we also need to keep strikes going on across the country. So if we... Because eventually we're going to get to the point where we've done this one, and then it's going to be several days before we can do another one. But the leader would help, right? The leader would definitely help with the strikes. I need more money! Uh, let's go leaders. Let me hire a leader, please. How much are you? Hundred and... Can I hire these people? Hopefully. 73, 74, 23 is rubbish. You, you seem to have rubbish stats with good belief or good stats with rubbish belief. Huh. I'm going to go for this gentleman just because his belief's really good. There we go. We're going to put you in the strikes. Hello. There we go. Perfect. So you're now doing our strike. We spent a bit of money there, so let's go to next turn. How are we doing on interviewing? You've got a little bit more to do. Probably done now, is it? Yes. So I reckon we should stop the interview there. We should interview our new dude. And we'll go next turn. Now let's have a look what articles. Okay, so we've got the BMP party in there. We're going to put an interview in. We could put one of those in. We probably need to stop on the BNP party thing going on at the moment. We'll put one of those in for next turn. We're going to print... Which affects voters more? Oh, wow. So the leaflets do much better. So if we go like that and press print, we should see a big jump in things going on. Um, let's go to our you and we're going to stop finding material on them and find some oh slander what if we slander hmm. let's try and slander uh, rank 2 and see what that does so let's go next turn we've got 630,000 supporters which is nice. Voters, even. Sponsors is going up. Budget's going up. Let's go to the map and see if we can afford to do a strike now we've got someone running them. Protests. Yes, we can. So we're going to do one in the west, like so. And we're going to go from 630 voters to... 723. That's what I'm talking about. It definitely jumps up better when you've got a leader in there. We're making £540,000 a turn at the moment, which is lovely. So we can actually start to buy more men and put them out on the streets, trying to build up our name. I find in the beginning, it, 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 there's not a lot you can do to affect it. But as you start getting more and more sponsors. So if we go to the next turn, it'll probably drop a little bit. Which it, it dropped a lot to 714. Which is a little annoying. We don't have enough money to do the East yet. So if we go next turn, I'm hoping we're going to get enough money, which we did. So we're going to organise one of those, and then we're going to jump up to 750,000. It's a bit annoying because it drops so quickly that you're sort of always counterbalancing yourself. But now we can go, now those are done, we've got a bit more time to hire people. So if we go to staff and hire, let's hire... Income after. So if we hire as many as we can, like so, and then we're going to go to the map and we're going to distribute them evenly across the board, send them out. Hopefully that will help situations. 750. Nope, it's still dropped massively. Hugely. Huh. We could get that one in, which would give us a plus two. And do you know what? If we put that one in, that's a plus two as well. So that would be really good. And let's stack some of these up for the next uh, uh, the next edition. And um, we're going to go like that. We're going to do 200. See, these are much better leaflets. Let's do all what we can. And we'll print it. And hopefully that will help a bit. 244 went... Yeah, you only get about 2,000 voters. Which is a bit rubbish. 
We are building up slowly though, slowly going up. We definitely need another strike in Scotland. How are we doing? Five more turns and we can probably get another strike. So let's go one, two. Okay, so money's going up. We could probably three. Oh, I feel like I'm skipping too quick, but. Hmm. Four and five. Right, that is two. Oh, we got a newspaper as well. So let's get one of those in there like that. Um, I think we're probably going to go with that. We'll get one of those, one of those, one of those for the next turn. We should probably start interviewing someone else. So you go to there. Now I don't want to spend all my money here. Let's do that and print. Oh, I need to hire more people. So we're definitely sending out more information. Can we do a organization? We can. There we go. Lovely. So we're going to go from 717 up to 957,000, which is a massive jump. I'm really happy with that. We are still bottom of this chart, but I'm hoping that improves at some point. We're not doing great in any particular area. Northwest seems to be the best. We're, we're, we're rank three in the Northwest. So we've still got quite a good budget. So if we go to headquarters, I think we should look at journalists. We should find someone who's really good on newspapers. Which we have got someone who's really good now. You're great on newspapers, leaflets and investigations. So we're going to hire you. Are we? Hmm, yes, we are going to hire you. You're good at investigations. Oh, we got a really good one. Let's hire you as well. So we've got a couple more journalists. The one I chose for newspaper, we have just bought him. Oh, we have to open the slot. Open the slot and we're putting him in there so it improves our newspaper. And this person we're going to task at, um, you're good at investigations. So compromising material for the Labour Party. I think that is a good idea. If you stop interviewing your bloke and start interviewing our main leader again, that would be nice. And now we just got to sort of skate along trying to spend our money and improve in our position. Protests, we got another three turns till that. So if we go, probably not three more turns. Let's go to staff. We're gonna hire some more campaigners which is going to cost us, let's spend one million. Let's do it. Let's spend the money. We're going to get those out in the world. So we'll go to here. We're going to go 100% equally to all regions like so, which is great. And then we can press next turn and hope for, I think it, I think those people may st uh, reduce the amount you drop in voters every turn. Maybe that's my thinking. Uh, now we've got to choose a new dogma. Now we don't have any dogmas available for for center left So we do have to go out of our comfort zone so we can go I'd say you can go either way by one um, Bring changes to the country through reforms Organizing protests for 20% less now that sounds that sounds very interesting to me One of the parameters of your party leaders has decreased to 50 well, that's not great, but I do think, I do think that less money for organizing protests is a great idea. Private property is forbidden. What? What? No private pop? No, 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 no. The, see, we've gone for this one, so we can't really go for this concept as well. So let's go for bring changes to the country through reforms. Accept and go with it. Okay, so can we do a protest yet? No, two more turns. So let's go forward two turns. Like so. And we are going to go protest and we can organize one in the south. Eventually, once we get more money, we can do strikes and protests. But at the minute, we can only do demonstrations. So let's do that. And we're going to go next turn. And we've got a lot of voters now. Is that a million voters? A Yes. Wow. Okay. Um, what, what have we got? A newspaper. Okay. So have we got anything interesting down here on Labour? Not really. Maybe we'll get rid of that and we'll put Labour in. 
And then in the next article, we'll have an interview with you. We'll have one of those, one of those, one of those. And I think that's everyone we've got anything on at the moment. We could put that in as well. Yeah, that looks good to me. And we're going to print as many as we can. Just print the lot. We're going to hire some more people to distribute distribute them. I can speak, I promise. And if we go next turn, we go to 1.058 million, is that what? I don't know. That's a lot of numbers. Just a lot of numbers. Uh, sponsors is good. We're making £764,000 a turn. So I think that's a great place to leave it. We are still on the bottom of the table, but by the next episode... By the end of the next episode, I hope to have climbed slightly. That would be nice. If you've enjoyed this episode, please hit that like button. And if you haven't done already, please subscribe. It really does help the channel. And until next time, I'll see you again.